Alright, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan Battle video. So, we got some pretty cool news today. According to iSeriously on Twitter, the latest Dokkan V-Jump leaks revealed that we are going to be getting a brand new Fighting Legend Goku slash Legendary Goku event style event in the near future. But this time, it's going to be featuring Vegeta instead of Goku. So I guess it'll be called the Fighting Legend Vegeta or Legendary Vegeta event, which obviously is something that a lot of people have been asking for, for, you know, forever, right? Like ever since the original Legendary Goku event came out, it just seemed obvious that we were going to be getting a Legendary Vegeta event, a Legendary Gohan event, a Legendary Frieza, Cell, Boo event, so on and so forth. I mean, there are a lot of characters in this franchise that have multiple stage transformations that would fit this format of an event, right? But that was like, I don't know, three, maybe four years ago since the original came out. And since then, we got the GT Legendary Goku event, and that's it, right? So either way, I'm glad that we're finally, it seems like, going to be getting other characters featured in this style of event. Vegeta's first, which makes a lot of sense. And uh, I think that's all we learned from V-Jump so far. There might be some other details that come out throughout the uh, week or within the next couple of days. But right now, we have this information and I am definitely very, very happy about it. Now, before we go, I do want to quickly talk about what the event would look like, what the stages would look like, right? So, popping over to the Dokkan Wiki here, we have the original Fighting Legend Goku and... There were eight different phases or stages in this one, starting with the base Goku, and then we had Super Saiyan Goku, Super Saiyan 2 Goku, Super Saiyan 3 Goku, Super Saiyan God Goku, Super Saiyan Blue, Super Saiyan, or sorry, uh, Ultra Instinct Sign Goku, and then finally uh, Ultra Instinct Goku for the boss. Now for this Vegeta, I think it's probably gonna be seven phases off the top of my head, unless they throw a curveball and include some non-canon Vegetas like Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta and Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta, which I don't think is likely because they did reserve those for the, like for Goku, they reserved the GT versions or the non-canon versions for the GT events, right? So uh, for Vegeta, yeah, I'm thinking seven phases. We'll start with, obviously, base Vegeta, and then we're gonna go Super Saiyan Vegeta, Super Vegeta, Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta, no Super Saiyan 3, we're gonna go to Super Saiyan God Vegeta, and then a Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta, obviously no Super Saiyan 4 here, and Super Saiyan Blue Evolution Vegeta as the final boss. Like I said, maybe they'll change it up because maybe they don't plan to do another legendary Vegeta event in the future, so they could like throw Super Saiyan 3 in there, maybe even Super Saiyan 4, I don't really know. Nothing's confirmed at the moment, but if I were to bet, I'm gonna say seven phases, and we go from base form, you know, Super Saiyan, Super Vegeta, Super Saiyan 2, Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Blue, and then Super Saiyan Blue Evolution. Now the arts might be different, we might actually get the AGL Super Saiyan Blue Evolution Vegeta. Actually, we're probably gonna get the AGL one instead of the Int one, but you never know, right? And uh, that is, that is it guys. Let me know in the comments down below how you guys feel about this. Are you excited for the Legendary Vegeta event? And what other Legendary Blank events do you want to see after this? Do you want to see Gohan, Frieza, Cell? I'm guessing for the villains, they'll probably do a different name because Fighting Legend sounds like something that you would reserve for like the, the heroes. So maybe for the villains, it's going to be Fighting Villain Frieza or something like that. I don't really know. Haven't thought about it too much, but we're definitely gonna get those in the future at some point. It might take years. It might be like the 10th anniversary before <laughs> we get one with, uh, you know, Cell or something like that, but it's coming, guys. It's coming. But Vegeta's next. Vegeta's next, and he should be dropping um, either at the end of this month or beginning of next month. So uh, definitely look forward to that. And I know some people were kind of expecting for V-Jump to reveal a new uh, Janemba, because it seems pretty obvious, right, that the next unit, the next LR on JP would be a Janemba, an LR Janemba, after the release of the 
Goku and Vegeta slash Gogeta. Uh, so far, we know nothing about that. No Twitter reveals, no leaks from my Seriously or Dokener or anything like that. But uh, I'm going to definitely keep my, keep my eye out. And if that news drops, I'll make sure to keep you guys posted, of course. And, uh, you know, do a live reaction to the animations too. So that's going to be fun. But for now, we got the Legendary Vegeta event slash Vegeta Rush slash uh, Fighting Legend Vegeta. So there you go. And uh, that's all I gotta say, man. Thank you so much for watching. Shout out to I Seriously for the post. And as always, if you guys liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you wanna stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here until next time. Hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.